Marge becomes possessed by a demon? The sub-episode starts with Marge choosing a bedtime story for Maggie. Strangely, the book entitled Pookadook keeps appearing, so she reads it to Maggie. But it's really scary, so she puts it back. That night, Maggie screams and cries. Marge sees the book on her baby's bed, which is peculiar. She tears it apart and disposes of it. The next day, Marge sees the Pookadook book on her doorstep. She burns it immediately. However, she inhales the smoke, allowing the demon to enter her body. Oh, time to put the baby down. Marge sends the family on an overnight trip to the aquarium, so she can be alone with Maggie. Maggie quickly escapes Marge's grasp and collects her weapons. She lures the Pookadook into the basement and shoots it until it slips down the stairs. The Pookadook wakes up all tied up. Maggie tries to get through to Marge by showing her sentimental things, but the Pookadook just laughs. While Maggie's busy, it escapes. Tired of the chase, Maggie gives herself up to the Pookadook. She caresses her mother's cheek, causing Marge to cough the demon out. Marge is back. Mommy's here. The Pookadook attempts one last hurrah, but Marge vacuums it up to its demise. So now you know.